Hi, I am Dr. Guru Karna Vemula, Senior Cosmetic and Plastic Surgeon and Managing Director of Personics Cosmetic and Plastic Surgery Center, Manikonda, Hyderabad. I want to talk about today about the tummy tuck, so which medically called as abdominoplasty. So people who are post bariatric surgery wear excess saggy skin with fat, have a big tires around the tummy, do spite of losing weight, but they don't get the proper shape to get the outfittings. So they do come to our center for reshaping abdomen. We offer them for the tummy tuck. And second kind of clientele are post-pregnancy, mother of two or three childs where there will be excess skin, saggy skin with an excess fat around the waist. They do come forward for this kind of procedure which is called tummy tuck. Where here at uh, Personix, uniquely we offer a laser liposuction along with tummy tuck. That means as uh, the first stage of treatment, we do a laser liposuction to thin out abdominal wall, we reduce the maximum amount of fat, excess fat which is accumulated in the upper abdomen and the low handles and the back and the front of the body. And after the laser liposuction, we then again assess the excess skin nature and that will be dealt with the tummy tuck. Like in tummy tuck, uh, mainly we go through that uh, phenenstein incision, which is the incision which is placed in the bikini line. What uh, like end of the day, the scar will not be visible in regular outfits. It will be located under the in the bikini. So through that lower abdominal incision, we go in, elevate the flaps, and we tighten the muscles which are got separated because of the pregnancy and thing. So once we tighten the muscles that gives a shape of the abdomen, the excess skin will be draped down and removed and the, all the flap layers and as per the anatomy, all the layers are repaired properly. Here because we combine with laser liposuction, fat in the flanks and upper abdomen is taken out, easy to drape the skin down. So the recovery process, uh, people will be more worried about the recovery process and the complication. To brief uh, about the complication like uh, infection, bleeding and the hematoma, which again more of technique dependent, if it proper technique is followed, it's again a rare complication. And uh, we sometimes use the drains, which will be placed for 48 hours and that will be out after 48 hours. The hospital stay will be one day. People will, patient will be advised a compression government post-operatively. Uh, we advise not to do the gym activity for at least two to three months as we repair the muscles. And regular walking and the uh, exercise can be done from the third week onwards. Most of the people can get back to their work by second to third week onwards. They can get back to their normal activities. So it's a pretty straightforward surgery where they lose, uh, they can get out of that huge tires which uh, very ugly looking and not allowing them to wear the proper fit. We can give a new life to the patient who underwent through this bariatric surgery or post pregnancy uh, post multiple pregnancy mothers so they'll get a freedom to wear a normal outfit